I'm Maureen Johnson and I'm the author of The Name of the Star. And right now I'm sitting in Mitre Square in East London and on the 30th of September 1888, it was pretty much on this exact spot, pretty much right in front of the bench here, that you would have found the body of Catherine Eddowes, who was the fourth victim of Jack the Ripper. And Jack the Ripper is very much a subject of this book. The story is about an American girl named Rory, who's from New Orleans, who comes to London to study for a year abroad. Unfortunately for Rory, she shows up at the same time that someone begins recreating the murders of Jack the Ripper, which were the famous unsolved murders of 1888 that took place in this area of London that we're going to see today. And extra unfortunately for Rory, she is around when one of the murders is committed and becomes the only witness and becomes involved with a branch of the English police force that is extremely secret. So right now we're actually going to go on a Ripper tour with some readers of the book. I was just saying that this particular tour guide we have, I've had about eight of these tours, and this guy is by far the goriest, most anatomically detailed. Uh, the tour, we've lost them. They're down there somewhere. But we're actually walking towards Wexford as we go down this street. This is the street next to the school. Can't believe we lost the tour. Oh. We have completely lost the tour. But I'll show you Wexford since we're here. And we're actually standing on Wexford right now, sort of fake geography. So there's a real building. That's Hawthorne, right up there with the three windows is Rory's room. So this is the building I stole, which is actually the Lillian Knowles house, which is a dormitory. And right here where, where the murder site would have been is where I've dropped a square. And then, uh, so basically I've just created a square here where there is in fact a parking lot. But there is at least one real building. We have an entire tour group of people trying to figure out where a building was, specifically Hanbury, the Hanbury Street location where Annie Chapman was killed. All internet reports I've ever read about it place it underneath this huge monstrosity kind of building here. So we're at the end of the tour now. Nobody has been murdered. We have all of our tour participants with us and we're sort of in the center of East London. And um, this is sort of where the book begins and ends. And I, if you read it, I hope you enjoy it. It's the name of the star. And um, thank you for coming.